Visual Arts Council's Satellite Gallery at Westfield Mall. We're so excited today because it's our opening reception. This is our Members Exhibit Showcase. We have over 50 artists represented and we have over 100 pieces that are hanging on the wall. We have so much going on. We have a program with AARP that's a year-long program that is enabling us to have two in-house exhibitions. We have online video classes. We have a wonderful gift shop. All artisan-made gifts. Nothing is manufactured. Even during COVID, we erupted. And on behalf of the legislature, myself, and Legislator Flanagan, we have this uh, proclamation for your opening and recognition. Congratulations, and here's to lots of art. Thank you. It's my honor to be here. I am a big supporter of the arts. The way that people get to express themselves in life is through art, whether that's by painting or photography or the spoken word. And here, to have this in the mall like this, it opens it up to so many people who've never actually maybe experienced art before. And now they're they're coming to, you know, Dick's Sporting Goods and they're gonna buy some sporting goods. And right next door is the, you know, the, the Arts Council. I think this is gonna be replicated throughout the country what's happening here reaching out to local artists, bringing them in, bringing in another population, which will help also save them all. So let's talk about our economics also. It's reaching art to another population who maybe weren't normally going to the museum. It's bringing the museum to the people. It's such a win-win partnership. Congratulations by some Arts Council and Westfield Mall are collaborating this way. When we were in COVID, we realized we missed each other. We missed our creative energy, sharing our ideas. We're here to honor all the local artists, meet, greet, and get to know each other and come together creatively. This is my piece, it's called Starry Starry Night. I mean, who doesn't love Van Gogh, but how do you do that as a photographer? So I have this thing where, I don't know if you can see the, the sky, and all this energy going on in the middle of nowhere, and six hours away from Manhattan, this magic going on in the sky that's available for us all. And all you have to do is tap in. I'm really thrilled to have my own little spotlight, but it's wonderful to be part of the brand new Islip Arts Council Gallery. And it was just so wonderful to be able to talk to a fellow artist about, you know, light and composition and all those things. These are three different series of work that has been created over time. All right, well, the bottom is all still life. These guys are all from a trip to Arizona that the family took a few years back. Upper row, I call it journeys, where I've just been to different places. Anytime I come across something that inspires me, you know, I take, I take the picture. When I first came to Suffolk County in 1969, there was nothing. When Ice of Arts Council formed, I was so thrilled because here we are having wonderful concerts and wonderful art, and I'm so looking forward to this coming year.